and that's it like who who's not a makeup artist who who's not a makeup artist let me know the book yeah oh, so hey guys so we're just gonna go ahead and jump straight into um the makeup first and then we're gonna do hair and then we're gonna get dressed but um yeah like i said we're just gonna do the makeup first so let's go ahead and get straight into that i'm gonna use the rest of my um little sample of this um smashbox uh primer to go ahead and prime my face. <clears throat> Ooh, so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and use this to prime, prime my face. For the beat. And then I'm sure as you guys see in the title, I'm gonna be using my new BH Cosmetics Hanging in Hawaii Palette. Oh my god, I love this palette. It's so freaking pretty. Yeah, it was. So freaking pretty. And it backed off when I thought it should be But yes, I'll be using this palette today on my eyes. Other than that, everything is going to be the same old, same old, regular, regular routine. Um, sorry for my face. I'm gonna do my eyebrows and I am taking my precisely my brow pencil from um, Benefit Cosmetics. I got put onto this from Tierra Walker. This eyebrow pencil is bomb. This eyebrow pencil is the freaking truth. So anyway, let's go ahead and do the brows and I'm just going to brush them up and I did um, wax my eyebrows with the glee facial wax strips um and so i got me like a little something like an arch or whatever hold on our postmates is uh coming right now hold on we gotta get our food so anyway we had to get our postmates food and i don't know what the hell's wrong with that postmates man but anyway Back to the video. So I just try my face. Like I said, I'm gonna go ahead and take my uh, precisely my brow pencil, and I'm gonna start out with my eyebrows. That look. That look gonna knock y'all down. Brush my little eyebrows up and over, up and over. And like lately, I just been kind of wanting just to fill in the tail end, cause really I just don't have nothing back there, like back that way. I got eyebrow in the front, I just don't have no eyebrow in the back. So I kind of just been filling in just the, um, let me see, just the tail end lately. Let me pull this mirror up. Let So, pause for the pause, because I'm finna eat. Okay, so I'm back, you guys. We just ate. So, let me hurry up with this video so I can go to bed. So, yeah. So, this eyebrow is done. Let's go ahead and go to that eyebrow. So, now, I feel like... Yeah, I'm gonna um, do my highlight and contour first, and I'm gonna go over that with um, foundation. That's how that's how I want to do this makeup routine this time. That's just how I'm feeling right about now. Okay, 
<laughs> all right so i'm gonna go in with my fenty concealer in the shade 300 I feel like I'm running low too. I need to get some more. And I'm just highlighting all the areas that I would normally want to highlight. And the reason why I say I'm um, going to highlight and contour before I put on my foundation this time is because I want a very soft, natural makeup no makeup look type of type of vibe Blender, so I'll be right back. Okay, y'all, my bad. So I do like to make sure my and it's dirty, so whatever. But I do like to make sure that my beauty blender is uh, wet with hot water. I went around with hot water and then I squeeze it out into a towel. And then by the time I get back over here, it's warm. So, cool. um, and then I do like to let my concealer sit a little bit so that it could like you know what I'm saying really get into my skin. Okay, and then I just go in and I start with my eyes and I just blend out the edges pretty much first. And go around. Keep bringing it around. And I kind of leave the middle section a little longer, like I said, because I want that to really absorb and pick up because I do have dark circles and I'm trying to conceal and now I'm just gonna go in over that last little bit and I'm bringing it all the way up over my eye because I am gonna be using eyeshadow today so I'm using it kind of like a base too up on the other one as well all right and then i'm gonna go in and take my maybelline i think this was a Yes, I think this is a translucent powder. It done rubbed off now, though. But I'm going to take my little Maybelline translucent powder. I can't even tell you how to shade, y'all. I don't even know. I don't know what happened to the bottom of this. I don't know. But I'm going to use that to go ahead and set all those areas. And for me, I just feel like this just helps me get a super flawless look like it just makes my lid come out looking like butter and that's the motherfucking goal I mean oops that's the bleep though I'll probably bleep it out whatever okay so now I'm gonna take my same Fenty concealer and now I'm gonna put it on my actual lid for real for real and really I need the um Carve out my brows. And normally, I don't use the applicator blur brush. I'm only using it now because I'm tired. 
but I want to get this video out for y'all because consistency is key and I'm gonna be consistent for real for real I'm going to contour again I'm going to take um, my Fenty con contour stick and the color well my Fenty match stick in the color suede y'all probably can't do that but whatever this is my match stick this is the color suede and so I'm just gonna contour where I normally would which would be like right here And like I said, this shade is not too dark on me. And you'll still be able to see it. And I like these. Anything smooth and creamy, mm, I like. I just feel like it's going to look so bomb on me. I like to contour my nose. Is. This is a Chic Pro Angle Blender Brush. I'm going to use this to go ahead and blend this contour out. how this little brush do this is I don't know what kind of brush this is either be as small I don't know but this is the brush I'm gonna use to go ahead and blend out the contour on my nose we already look at slick snatch like psh, psh. here we go we're gonna really take off all right so this is what I'm used to go ahead and um, blend out the contour on my nose and I like to like blend it into my eyebrow like right under it kind of like right here whatever this part of the eyebrow is now what I'm gonna go ahead and do I'm gonna go ahead and do my eyes And um, I don't do no heavy eye makeup ever. Like you're never, ever going to catch anything like that. Well, let me stop saying that. Because like I said, I do want to broaden my little horizons. And I want to, you know, take leaps and try new things. And I did get this new different, um, this palette from BH Cosmetics with all these colors in it. And I do want to try them out. I'm going to try to recreate some looks. So whatever. But this palette right here that I got from BH Cosmetics, this is the Hanging in Hawaii palette. And I just think it's so bomb. The colors is just so me. It's just so pretty. And I don't do nothing heavy. So the look I'm going to do is going to be something very light. Something, you know, you could just chill. You could have a little brunch, a little date night. You know what I'm saying? You, don't even, you know, a night on the town. It don't even matter. But it's going to be universal. It's going to be a universal look. So, um... I just feel like this palette is just perfect for that. So this is the palette that I'm going to be using. And this look is going to be very quick, very wham bam, naked man. It's going to be so simple. And I got this, um, this is a Sephora Daily Brush cleanser and so pretty much you just spray this on any brush or makeup on it and you wipe it off and boom it's clean i also just ordered this um dry makeup brush cleaner from amazon i got put on that from this girl on tiktok i think i'm gonna start out with coconut i think i'm gonna start out with coconut I 
I'm just gonna take coconut and I'm gonna blend it all in my crease. All in my crease. This color is just so freaking pretty. I'm just, in, y'all, like, I'm gonna probably use this palette every day. Like, now I'm going to be able to make a video every day because this is just so bomb. Again, I'm just taking that coconut color, and like I said, I, I'm no makeup artist, so I just be moving real quick, dibbling and dabbling. But yeah, I'm just taking this coconut color, like I said, all in the crease, blending it to where I see fit. And now, that's just with coconut on there. So now I'm going to, hmm, now I'm going to take, now I'm going to take, now I'm going to go in and I'm going to go with Ohana this pretty pink color because I just literally cannot resist and I'm gonna put this all over my lid and I'm just kind of like patting it and this color is so freaking pretty oh my god this color is so freaking pretty I was tired. I'm woke now. This color is so freaking pretty. <sighs> so freaking pretty. And now I'm gonna go in. Now I'm gonna go in with this. Um, what color is this? Mahalo. That's this color right here. I'm gonna go in with Mahalo. And I'm going to like, I don't know what you want to call it, like cut the crease with it, but I'm going right into the crease with this color to like, I don't know, give it some more depth, make it pop a little bit more. But I don't know, that's just how I'm feeling. So we taking Mahalo directly on the crease. Now I'm gonna bring it over on a little bit. Now I'm gonna take that brush that had coconut on it and I'm just blending that out. Just gonna blend them all in, let them colors marry. I went a little 
OD with this eye, so I'm gonna go back in with a little coconut and blend it out. Now I'm gonna go in with Waikiki. Oh, now I'm gonna take Waikiki, which is here, and I'm gonna take that into my inner corners right here. Just to give it a little, just to give it a little oomph. Mm, just a little. This is so fucking pretty. Yeah, I'm blowing my own mind. Like, since when I ain't a makeup artist? Since when? I'm done with my eyes for now. I still gotta do my eyeliner and stuff like that, but I'm gonna put the foundation on first. So now I'm taking my Born This Way um, Too Faced foundation in the color Sand. If y'all wanna see that, that is the color Sand. And what I like to do is take the, the booty part of the Beauty Blender and I just put some dots on it. Like, bink, 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 bink. Wipe. All right, and then I just pretty much like, you know what I'm saying? Double dabble all over the face, like bang, 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 bang. And then I blend it all out. Watch how this just come together. Watch how we like. <laughs> Y'all feeling me yet? Y'all feeling me yet or not? Now see how that look natural? Like I'm still contoured. I still have highlight. I'm still concealed. My nose is still snatched. Okay. We just, you know what I'm saying? We just reversed it a little bit. You know what I'm saying? It's cool to reverse it's that split. Period, Pooski. Alright. 
so boom so now that i feel like that's good now i'm going to go in with my born this way um concealer and this is in the color light beige and I, i'm just gonna use like a tad bit just a tad now I'm gonna go boom, 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 boom. All right, just about that much, and just go back underneath my eye a little bit. Go ahead and go in with the BH Cosmetics. Why can't I open this thing? Why can't... Right, my BH Cosmetics bronzer in the color Bronze Babe. I'm just gonna take this fluffy brush. This is a angled face brush. And I'm just gonna. Whoa. That was OD. So. <laughs> Ooh, chat. That was a bit worse. <clears throat> Damn, yeah. Now this side is right. The other side, I'm gonna have to uh, figure some things out. back and take my Maybelline translucent powder and we're gonna tone this right on here we're gonna turn this tone this down because that was just too much and I learned the little translucent powder trick from <laughs> see Jackie Miss Jackie I know of course okay yes tone her the fuck down And I'm also going to take a bit more of this translucent powder. And we're just going to carve this right on out. That's it. But it's a second. Fenty Beauty um, Hot uh, Kilowatt, and I got the colors uh, or the highlights: Me Money and Hustler Baby. 
how do I make y'all see? Boom. So that's me, money, and hustle baby, and I mix them both. I just put the thing in both. Eyeliner, and I don't know what kind of eyeliner this is. I think it's Kiss, but I ain't sure. It's something cheap. I'm not sure. We finna line these eyes. Strong hold 3D eyelash glue, put these lashes on real quick. And I love this um, lash glue because you literally just paint it on where you want your lashes at and stick them holes on there. for just a second that's all it takes boom get my lashes together these are lashes from my um collection from my website ebonylux.com this is the lash style charmaine lashes on now I'm gonna take this BH cosmetics um, warm brown uh, liner and I'm gonna use it to line my lips Now I'm gonna go in with this matte 
um, lip cream. It is, it's from Cream Licious. It's also from Ruby Kisses too. I got this out of Beauty Supplies though. These are so bomb. I got so many. They go a purple one. Look. I got so many. Um, but this color, y'all know I love pink. But this is so bomb. And this is in the color Tickle Me Silly. This is an 18 inch frontal and then I have in 26, 26, 24. Um, on me, it's pretty long. I think it comes down to like the middle of my butt, I think. And this is my Brazilian straight hair. It is just so freaking pretty to me. Um, I do need to take it off and redo the lace, but um, I don't have no more alcohol. None of the other freaking um, stores around me have any alcohol. And so I guess I'm gonna have to go and get like um, lace glue, actual lace glue remover. But I did see somebody, ouch. I did see somebody um, on YouTube say they took theirs out with hot water. They got the glue off with hot water. Not on the head, but like off the lace. Like that's what I'm mainly worried about. I'm not too much worried about getting it off my head. I know I can use like just warm water to get it off my head. I'm just worried about um, getting it off of my lace. That's the main thing I'm worried about. And my lace is dirty right now. I don't know if I can really tell, but the lace is dirty right now. So it's like, mm, I think it might be okay though. Yeah, if y'all want to take some pictures after I'm done with this video. Um, and I'm probably just going to run a flat iron over this hair real quick. Ooh, that video I had made earlier today on that unboxing my BH Cosmetic. I didn't even brush my damn hair. It was looking a mess in that whole video. But it's cool. I know what I really look like. Y'all know what I really be giving. You know what I'm saying? You don't. You know what I'm saying? You can just go check out my little Instagram whatever. You know what I'm saying? It's love.ebonique L-O-V-E dot E-B-O-N-I-Q-E -E, if you didn't know. But um yeah. So, this is pretty much all I'm gonna do for my hair. I mean, I'm gonna do these little baby hairs real quick. Like, so. Like, cause I, I molded my baby hairs down with mousse, my little Nairobi mousse. I need some more. So they kinda like in position. So it makes it really easy to just bing bong boom. I might not even flat iron this hair, honestly. Because I'm ready to go. So this is pretty much it for hair. I'm just gonna have a little, where my comb go? I had a comb, where'd it go? Dang, there it go. Oh so, yeah. So let me go get dressed and we'll be right back for final look all right you guys so this is the final look i think it came out really cute i think it's a very simple look like if you're going on a date or if you're going to lunch 
this is the bag and i think it's getting real cute so you guys make sure you subscribe to my channel and let me know what you think